This is the Morpheus workstation. Standalone, resurfacing, remodeling station. If you already have great photofacial, you already have great laser hair removal, you don't need a surgical system, then you might consider a standalone Morpheus uh, workstation. On this workstation, you get two opportunities. You get the Morpheus body, which has the burst mode, and you get the Morpheus face. A black applicator, you get the 24 pin, the prime, and the resurfacing tip option but no burst. And I use that on the face, on the body. You can use it anywhere you want, but you can only go as deep as four millimeters. You do multiple passes, four, three, two, and one. The other option is the body that also comes on the Morpheus workstation. Most of these Morpheus applicators go across several platforms, the Optimus, the Embrace, the Body Tight, and the Empower. The body applicator allows you the burst mode. That's 40 pins and you get 753 or 642 burst or 5 and 4 burst or you can go unburst and just do millimeter by millimeter. We're going to do um, a fixed or cycle. The cycle put your foot on the fat, uh, on the pedal and it fires um, every second and we're going to do one pulse per second. So one pulse per second cycle mode, 4 millimeters of depth, 50 millimeters of energy and then we'll do a second pass at 3 millimeters and we'll turn that down a little bit to maybe 45 millijoules per pin. And so the company will give you safe settings and then you're gonna decide what settings work best for you. Beautiful, 50, 40, 30, four, three, and two, three passes. If you look at the skin, there's edema, little welting. This is a good edema to sign. I don't see any lines of deepithelialization and no, um, no epidermal lysis. So this is a good treatment. That's a good treatment. That was all done. You can zoom out now a bit uh, if you want, Greg. That was done under um, topical and nitrous. Pretty aggressive settings. And we are at 25 millijoules per pin. Jim is stretching. Why is it important to stretch? If you don't stretch, it just pushes the skin. It doesn't penetrate. And a, a couple of practices said, well, I did the Morpheus burst and I got some marks. Now you can get marks because if you don't stretch and the pins fire, they can coagulate as they're going through, which is epidermal dermal ablation stretch. So they go through and then they blow up from the inside out. Okay, so be very important to stretch the skin when you're doing body treatments because most patients are a bit wiggly jiggly. Okay? Now you can do that right after you've done the transform and that doubles down on the outcome.